Closing market comments for Wednesday, March the 31st. Well, the highly expected March 31st planting detentions and March 1 stocks report was released today at noon, and it was a surprise. The stocks numbers came out with soybeans at 1.564 billion bushels. That's above the guess of 1.537, but below last year at 2.255. The corn stocks came out at 7.701 billion bushels. That's below the average guess of 7.770 and below last year at 7.952. Wheat stocks came out at 1.314 billion bushels. That's above the average guess of 1.271 and below last year at 1.415. So a little friendly corn, probably a little negative beans of wheat. But then the surprising part of the report. Soybean acres came out at 87.6 million. That's below the average guess of 90.1 and above last year at 83.1. The corn acres came out at 91.1 million, below the average guess of 93.1 and barely above last year at 90.8. So shocking numbers on both the corn and beans, over 2 million acres below expectations. Winter wheat acres came out at 33.1 million. The average guess was 31.8 with 30.4 planted last year. Total wheat acres was 46.4 with the average guess of 44.9 and the acres last year at 44.3. So 2.1 million acres more wheat planted and we're only going to gain uh, 300,000 acres of corn and uh, 4.5 million acres of beans. So quite a bit of a shock in the numbers. Market rallied sharply after the report was released. Corn closed the day up limit at 25 cents. Soybeans up the limit at 70 cents and wheat was up 16 cents on the day. Limits are expanded for tomorrow because of the report and the limit up move. Uh, so corn limits tomorrow will be 40 cents and soybean limits will be a dollar and five cents. So it'll be interesting to see what this market, how it reacts. The other factor is we got no markets on Friday because of Good Friday. So you have quite a few people that are going to be leaving early so that we have that factor in the markets as well. So going to be an interesting situation with these numbers. We're going to have to see how the trade will react tomorrow after the limit up move today. At one point there was 120,000 contracts of corn offered to be bought with nobody selling. So that's the reason for the limit up move. Unfortunately, when the market does start trading, those 120,000 seem to disappear. So we'll have to see what it does. I really don't know what to expect out of tonight's market with no markets Friday or tomorrow night. The uh, stocks report also came out for oil. Uh, crude oil 501.8, down 900,000 barrels. Gasoline 230,000, 500 million or 230.5 million. That's down 1.8 million and distill at 144.1 million, up 2.5 million. Ethanol production up 965,000 uh, from 922, so up 43,000. And compares to 840 last year, we started the ethanol shutdown last year because of COVID. Ethanol stocks 21.114 million barrels. That's down 695,000 from the previous week and 4.603 below last year. So interesting report, interesting numbers, huge reaction to it. Will it continue? That's the big question. Thanks for listening. Have a good evening.